Jehovah Shammah. That's what we're going to talk about today on Strength for Today. This Tuesday, July the 8th, and this is camp week, so come on out to the camp and we'll have a great time together morning, evening, and night. And we're trying to teach the children and young people about the Lord and encourage them to draw nigh to God. I want to send this broadcast out to Terry and Beverly today. They reminded me that there are other people who are listening to the broadcast as well as they. And so I hope Terry and Beverly enjoyed today's broadcast. Jehovah Shammah, the Lord who is present. God is never absent. He's always on the job. He's always there for us. Ezekiel uh, tells us uh, in verse 48, verse 35, there's around about 18,000 uh, measures there in that chapter. And the name of the city shall be the Lord is there. And folks, I want you to know the Lord is not only in heaven, but the Lord is in your heart by the Holy Spirit of God. He's ever present. He's ever present in the time of need. He'll never leave you nor forsake you. If you look in the Greek, that word never is repeated 37 times. I'll never leave thee nor forsake thee. I don't care what you're going through today or what troubles may be around you or what flood might be trying to overflow you. Remember, he's present. He's not going to leave you. There's nothing to fear. He will protect his own. Then the last one is Jehovah Rapha, which is the Lord is our healer. I think this is real appropriate now that we've got a little baby in the hospital that the Lord has touched in a mighty way that probably shouldn't have made it, but she's doing so much better. She's off all of her IVs and everything, and now she's just taking uh, milk and growing each and every day. Jehovah Rapha. I've got a lady who had a bad infection in her elbow. They operated. Everything came out good, and now she's coming home today, and uh, Jehovah Rapha, the Lord is our healer. Today, we've got another lady having open heart surgery. They did a catheterization, no blockages, and maybe now they can do the surgery without having to do open heart. Jehovah Rapha. We anointed her with oil Sunday morning and prayed for her. Exodus chapter 15, verse 26 says, And said, If thou wilt diligently hearken to the voice of the Lord thy God, and will do that which is right in his sight, and will give ear unto his commandments, and keep all his statutes, I will put none of these diseases upon thee, which I have brought upon the Egyptians, for I am the Lord that healeth thee. That word Lord is Jehovah Rapha. I don't know what physical ailment you may have. Give it to God. He's the great physician. He's the healer of all healers. He's Jehovah Rapha. And he'll be your strength for today and your hope for tomorrow.